Don't ball watch. Don't ball watch. That one then, as we spoke about, couple ball watch then. Get your man and then you can sort of see where the ball is. Are we knocking on here because you're free? Come to that. Yes, yep, yep. Hold outside? Yep. Hold outside. I'll come back. Hold here, hold here. Get him. Birch, hold! Birch! Birch! Back in the middle! There! There! Up! 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 When we're squeezing up, yeah. I know we say don't go over, but if they've got a spare, right, come, come in and then the other person can come right. around. But that's perfect. You tick back up, yeah. just go out the ball. Yeah. Great spot here again. No, hey, hey. That's why you got the ball. You going out there? Yeah. Hey, just watch, just watch when we go forward. Their wings are sitting out. Yeah. We don't have to squeeze up to them. You were that worried about any bets then. Yeah. You've come up here and then you've gone back to find him. Yeah. What's our rule? Listen, we need to keep squeezing up. Dimmer's going back to get bets with that big gap. Keep squeezing, pushing yeah. us up. Hey, wingers, half forward. Hey, 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 hey. They were just saying, yeah. two man conscious. Yeah. When the ball's out, make sure you're in front right, yeah. and back yourself. Yeah, if you need yeah, to get, you go and get yeah, it. Yeah. Right, let's get hey, boys, organized. boys, remember? It's about two minutes to go. Let's be a bit smarter now. Yeah, hey, mate. Hey, hey, play on, play on. That's play on. That's play on. That's play on. Oh. Did he go off the mark? Dimma, Birch, Birch, you sit here, Dimma, you sit back here. Dimma, Birch, Birch, hold there. Dimma, back, Dimma, back. We want run from behind, not those lead ups. We want to run past him in that space. Dimma, good spot, we've got to move up from here. Yep, yeah, me and you, mate, me and you. What'd you do with that 50 stoppage? Took off the four. Huh? Hey, hey. Uh, Did you have someone? Uh, I think it was a four, and then he spat out. You stay with him. Yeah. You stopped, his heels there, you go with him. Yeah. You know that last one? Yeah. You're standing there. For us to get the drop off, what do we need you to do? Get a bite. Yep. You turn to your left, we got one V2. Welcome back to the Virgin Australia Sunday Soapbox. You reckon, Jimmy, that uh, Cooper, Chase and Leo would be getting good instruction from <laughs> Father Luke at home? Geez, that'd be a well-organised unit in the backyard, wouldn't they? But, Hodgie, you see there with a lot of younger players, how's the difference? You've played with a lot of experienced players. What's the different tone in your messages compared to a young group to the experienced group of the Hawks you used to have? Yeah, I guess... Um, well, you, you could sort of see there with Birch. Um, I guess the people were surprised that my most... I guess the loudest and the hardest I yelled at someone was to Ruffy and Birch. Probably my two closest mates at the footy club. Uh, with the young, with the guys these days, it's all about education and trying to teach them the right way to go about it out there. As you said, in the past, there was older blokes, experienced defensive line, you could just sort of say whatever you wanted to. But our job now as, as older guys out there is to try and teach the guys so they can develop faster. I thought it was a fascinating vision, and you've set a very high bar for anyone else who gets taped up. I don't know whether anyone else is wanting to do it. And Because we've always thought that you are a fantastic on-field captain coach, Thursday night proved it. Proved it. It was just fantastic. Have you heard uh, many coaches, uh, captains, when you're out on the ground, Lee, almost coach like that? Well, no, not to be honest, no. And I think, to be honest, in, and you probably would agree, Hodgie, if you're playing the back half, you'd think of Nick Maxwell might have been a voice like that, but I don't know about you, Jimmy. Who, who else has been out there that's do, giving anywhere near that level of instruction in your playing time? Yeah, well... You, you touch on it there, it's the position they play and as you can see, Hodger, you, you've got the game in front of you and you can mm. see where guys need to move. I had Tom Harley at one stage who was again across that centre half back line and he could see it but I've also had Cameron Ling on ball so mm. it's a bit harder and it depends what other teammates you got there helping. You've got Birch who can probably see the game really well. Yeah, I think the difference from out the Hawthorne three years ago is we had six blokes in the defence who all played 150 games or more so you probably didn't have to talk as much or um, I guess teach as much out there where I think we had four of the blokes in our defensive end on the weekend played under 30 games. Yeah. So the, the mindset changes a lot.